People often ask us, what's the car that Local Motors makes? We like to answer that by really taking the discussion back a notch and saying, when you're looking for a car in your local area, how often do you find a car that really responds to the things that are necessary or the things that you desire the most in your area or the things that make you most excited about a hometown hero? I like to think of Local Motors sometimes as a sports team. Think of the football league, the National Football League, if you will, or think of sort of something like the NBA. Uh, it is a place where you find a federation of teams that do effectively the same thing. When was the last time that you were in Boston and you went to a baseball game and said, this baseball game looks different than a baseball game that I saw in Texas? Probably never, because the game is played by the same rules. It's a league. It's a federation. However, when was the last time that you met someone who was born in Boston and was a good old Giants fan, or a Texas Rangers fan, or an Orioles fan. I think it would be a cold day in hell if you found a Boston fan turncoat on his team, the Red Sox, like that. We look at Local Motors and its micro factories in the same way. This is something that's never existed before in the car industry. Something where you can feel pride. Something where you can say, hey, I know many people, in fact, who work at a Local Motors micro factory. Local Motors micro factories will be more like a federation or a league of exciting micro factories around the country, each of which builds cars that embody the pride and the elegance and the excitement and the performance specification of their local area. And if for nothing else, they were simply made there and they become a hometown hero. That's what local motors micro factories are all about.